Mr. My name is Deirdre. I'm from the School of Law. I was just wondering how you meant, uh, announced uh, about the tribunal for neighborhood disputes. Oh. Yeah, I was just wondering when they'll be implemented. Apart from this tribunal, what else can you do to improve neighborhood disputes? Uh, okay. Um, it's so the tribunal. I don't know if the rest of you have been following this. This is a tribunal to help resolve very difficult neighborly disputes. Today they go for mediation. Mediation is simply a third party coming with the two people who are in dispute trying to work out a win-win solution. Mediation is not mandatory. Mediation is not the same as adjudication. It doesn't result in, I mean, it may or may not have positive outcomes. So what we have seen is that I think 70% of the cases do lead to positive outcomes after mediation, but quite a number don't even want to turn up for mediation. And even those who get a positive outcome from mediation, sometimes after a while, somebody, something flares up again. So you have, you're back with a, another di difficult problem. So after many con rounds of focus groups, discussions and, uh, and thinking about this, we decided on a community tribunal which will be overseen by a judicial officer and uh, the parties will come forward with their case and uh, the tribunal will have to make a decision, right? One way or the other, issue an order. It could be an order against a party not to continue making noise after a certain time or whatever, which will have to be enforced. And if, it, if the person doesn't comply with the order, there will be consequences. So that's something that we are developing possibly by the end of the year to put in place. Um, it's to us a last resort sort of thing. You know, the best outcome we want to see is we set up a tribunal, but it ought to be a tribunal that is ra rarely invoked. Right? So we've set this up really as a last resort. If after mediation, after going through all these different ways of trying to resolve your issues, you still can't resolve, um, hopefully now there's one avenue. Particularly, I think, for those who are facing a lot of, uh, who are victims, uh, right? That means they are genuinely victims of a neighbor who's, say, harassing them, making a lot of noise late at night. Today, they don't really have any recourse. So we, we are thinking that a tribunal like that might provide them some legal recourse to get, to, to get something done for them.